The latest episode of the strange bout between Mike Tyson and Jake Paul has the internet community in a frenzy. Paul's recently made public training video has the fight community, or maybe more appropriately, curious onlookers, on edge as they wait to see how the two titans of combat sports will respond. <laughs> in the fitness center, as he sees a video of Jake, Mike Tyson's voice reverberates across the room. Paul's most recent shenanigans on a nearby phone, a smile extending over his face as he laughs at what they dare to refer to as training film. It's more like a highlight reel appropriate for a brisk morning run. He recoils his head. The sound reverberating off the exercise equipment like rolling thunder makes Tyson chuckle heartily. Jake Paul appears to believe he's prepared to take on characters like Iron Man thanks to his advanced footwork training and shadowboxing. Mike Tyson gives an unbelieving shake of his head. At Paul's camp, they must be viewing a whole other video with a stern tone. Tyson talks about the ridiculousness. Permit me to share with you. He starts out by speaking with the weight of his illustrious career. When I was younger, going to training seemed like going into combat, where every drop of perspiration and every instant of tiredness was a sign of our dedication. The constant worry was that they will unintentionally be knocked out. Then a teammate strikes, and this Paul character responds with a couple weak blows, thinking he's ready for the real deal. It's nearly absurd. They call it a mismatch, but to Tyson, it's more like a foregone conclusion, a lesson in humility waiting to be administered. Sure, he may have a few more years under his belt, but the fire within still rages this fight. It's a walk in the park, an easy paycheck, and an opportunity to teach these young upstarts what real strength looks like. Tyson leans in and examines Paul's physique through the screen. He resembles a pumped-up high school cheerleader, all flash but lacking substance. Those arms may impress at first glance, but they lack the power to back it up. If you're paying attention, Jake Paul, keep working those muscles because you'll need every bit of strength Tyson brings to the ring. It's going to be an epic battle, nothing like a kid's play. When Tyson is done with him, you could find yourself missing the days of crazy things on YouTube. Joe Rogan, in the meantime, cuts to a clip of Jake Paul training for his podcast, his voice commanding attention as he speaks to the viewer. Paul's progress is noted by Rogan, who also praises the kid's agility and the commitment seen in Paul's footwork. Rogan observes, granting credit where credit is due. Rogan Paul actually does some wild He's yeah, really he, good. He, he, he does some wild He really does. Were jumping off the top ropes and slamming into each other in yeah. the middle. like, that's yeah. some serious yeah. athleticism. Yeah, yeah. I, I tell him, both those kids are half tough. Yeah. Take yeah. nothing away from them. No, I, I mean, people want to take something away from them because they're YouTube people. I always tell people, watch, just forget that Jake Paul is a YouTube guy and watch him box. Yeah. The kid can fight. 100%. Yeah. And that Tommy Fury fight yeah. really showed that. I mean, it goes to a split decision against a legit undefeated box. Now let's face facts. Paul would have been eliminated by Tyson sooner than you could say in his heyday. YouTube sensation. But as they say, time heals all wounds. And at 57 years old, Tyson must confront the inevitability of aging. Is it possible for this legendary figure to resurrect even a little portion of his former greatness? Teases of Tyson's training provide an enticing look at the solution. This vicious jab rattles the heavy bag, and then a lightning-fast right hook sends it tumbling in all directions. Tyson's forehead is dripping with sweat, yet his motions reveal an unexpected dexterity. Even though I may be perceived as old and washed up, according to Tyson, the fire inside of me is still quite strong. The iron mic they remember is still here, even though I may have aged a few years. Although his trainer gave him a doubtful look, Tyson's blows have unquestionable force. His deep focus in his look says a thousand words. This is not just a marketing gimmick. While the viral videos show off Tyson's skills, questions remain about how much of this resolve is real and how much is just fantasy. Tyson seems sincere in his attempt to prove he still has the required press. The unanswered question remains, can Tyson maintain this intensity for the whole of a fight? Will his deteriorating reflexes be quick enough to stop a younger, faster opponent in Tyson's inner circle? There is silence. Though he might not be the same unstoppable force as before, there is still cautious optimism and the conviction that he has enough knockout power to deter any opponent. 
One trainer for Tyson once said, you can never underestimate the tenacity of a champion. Iron Jake Paul, the outspoken YouTuber who turned boxer and has been making waves in the ring, received a strong warning from Mike recently. When Tyson stated that he's ready to fight Paul if the opportunity presents itself, he didn't mince words. Tyson's knockout prowess and formidable reputation make this a formidable test, especially considering his signature intensity. Tyson sent Jake Paul a message without holding back. Feel the heat in his voice as he cautions, be prepared to dance the tango with the toughest man on the planet if you want to spar. Kid, I'll send you into it the following week. I'll redefine strength if you believe you are strong. For Tyson, the message is more important than the appearance. He has scars to show that he has experienced it all. Jake Paul represents a new generation of fighters who require a wake-up call, they need to be made aware of the real costs associated with competing against a living great, such as Mike Tyson. Despite this, Tyson's matchup with Jake Paul has the potential to earn him up to $245 million. The world of combat sports is buzzing with excitement about this possible showdown between the Titans. Talk has been sparked by the social media star Jake and the renowned Mike Tyson's most recent training video, but the real controversy surrounds his audacious claim of a hopping $500 million. Winner takes all award. To put it bluntly, a prime Tyson would have destroyed Paul faster than a popular hashtag. But A is unbeatable, and Tyson, who is now 57, begs the question, can a young contender take advantage of a legend's weaknesses, Jake? Paul, for example, seems to be convinced that the days of ostentatious Instagram feeds and stage confrontations with other influencers are over. The most recent training video shows a changed Jake Paul who exudes a determined purpose and improved accuracy in his footwork. His blows resound with more power, and a steely purpose shines in his eyes, dispelling the idea that this is just a YouTube show. In a recent interview, Paul affirmed that the goal is to win a $500 million reward. I'm not here to play games, I'm here for the fight of a lifetime, and I'm gunning for everything Tyson has left," he says, his voice resonating with furious intent. He emphasizes the scope of his goals by slanting toward the camera. $500 billion, it's revolutionary. Are you really thinking that I'll allow anyone to get in my path, particularly those experienced combatants? The training video itself is proof of Paul's steadfast dedication. His previous bout's haphazard motions are already gone, replaced with a relentless ambition that drives him to push himself to the very limit while drenched in perspiration. It's unclear if this translates into actual fighting ability against an experienced brawler like Tyson, but one thing is certain, Paul isn't going into this fight, acting like a random social media star warming up for a friendly showdown. Rather, he's studying Tyson's strategies in detail, figuring out where he stands, and preparing for a fierce fight. His claims contain a faint undertone of hubris, the conviction that youth can overcome wisdom and overwhelming power. The matchup between a young hungry fighter motivated by big money and a seasoned veteran looking to prove his mettle again looks exciting, but in the excitement, it's important to remember that there is still risk involved, even for the older fighter. Mike Tyson is still a dangerous animal who is ready to strike at the mention of Iron Man. Mike Paul knows that landing a single punch will make him feel anxious, yet he doesn't hide from this fact. Paul's admonitions include a supply nuanced mix of caution and affection. In a different interview, Paul acknowledges that I recognize Tyson's achievements. He is without a doubt a legend, but legends don't always last. He addresses Tyson directly and highlights the $500 million reward with a tinge of defiance. Please take this as formal notice, he said. Mike, I'm coming for you, and I'm not going to give up on you. The fate of Paul's audacious G gamble remains uncertain, teetering between triumph and a sobering realization of reality. Nevertheless, one thing is certain, this strange David vs. Goliath match, in which the stakes are elevated beyond anything seen before, will captivate viewers worldwide. That concludes today's video. Please remember to subscribe, like, and ring the bell button if you liked it. This will ensure that you never miss any of our future films. You can also leave your comments below with your ideas. Keep watching and we'll see you in the subsequent video.